Good afternoon, Brett coming to you live from mid-Michigan, and it is a beautiful late February Friday afternoon. And today I bring to you something a little bit different for me. I'm a truck guy, I'm usually into trucks. So why the 2015 Chevy Cruze? Well, picked this up a couple months ago for my youngest daughter. And um, through her new employment, she just picked up a 2021 brand new GMC Terrain. So this little cruise uh, becomes an extra vehicle for us that we no longer need. Thus the reason we're selling it. Now, first thing I did is I took it to my mechanic and had him check everything out. It needed a new water pump and um, brakes on the front end. Other than that, he said it uh, is a fantastic motor, checks out mechanically and the car backs that up through its appearance and the way that it uh, runs and drives. So I concur with uh, my mechanic. And let's check out the front end there. As you can see, nice clear lenses, which I really like. And if you look at that front splitter, that lower piece down there, those are usually all scuffed up. People hit curbs with them, etc. This one's really sharp. And look at the motor. Now this is GM's um, 1.4 liter Ecotec. It's, so it's a, it's a turbocharged four cylinder, which I really like because it has plenty of power for this little car. And uh, yet it's very economical. And you can see just how nice and clean everything is. Silver, I think, is the right color for this car. And I like those um, factory aluminum rims that it came with. The interior is very clean. Bucket seats, console. Um, I really like the gauge package on it. Everything works. Rear defroster, cruise tilt, uh, AM, FM, CD, no rips or tears. The, the dash has no rips or tears. The seats don't. It does have a little bit of uh, paint chipping there. Who knows what that is caused from. Rear seat, very nice. It does have the closest thing to a little bit of a, it's, it's not really a tear. But uh, there is a little bit of a, I'm going to call that a ruffle. <laughs> I don't know if that's a technical term or not. But overall, very nice condition. Good tires. Good tread on the tires. You know, a pretty nice trunk for a small car. I was very pleasantly surprised. You can fold down the rear seats and you can haul, you know, some, some nice stuff in this thing. And again, I like how the, uh, the, 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 the lights on this car are nice and clean. They're not uh, all foggy like you typically see in a lot of used cars. No rust, no rust at all. Uh, got a little, little dinger right there, but that's about it. Other than some scratches here and there, but nice car overall. So let me shut everything up here. Could you hold that? Please. Let me get everything shut up here. Okay. And just want to show you how she looks with the doors all ever everything closed. I think it's a pretty nice looking little car. And uh, you can see good tires. I like the way it drives too. I mean, I'm comfortable. I'm a big guy. I'm north of uh, 300 pounds. And uh, once I get in this thing, I find it very comfortable. So let's take the cruise for a little cruise.
age old that. Got both key fobs, which I like. And, and these key fobs have keys in them. And then it has this key as well. So it's kind of cool. She shows 69,012 miles on the on the clock. Nice looking gauge package. Like I said, um, AM, FM, CD, uh, air conditioning, of course, cruise control, tilt, uh, rear window defrost, power windows, power locks. It drives really nice really solid what i like about this car uh, <laughs> our roads in southern michigan here are notoriously crappy uh roads and um th this car when you drive over these uh ruts and stuff like that it doesn't shake rattle and roll it's nice and tight the front end is nice and tight my man Carter just put some new brakes on it so it stops nice as you can see here it is a just a beautiful day and we're due <laughs> we February was uh, tough I mean we had the ton of snow and a lot of really cold weather so nice to see things starting to turn around and uh, spring is right around the corner let's hope this transmission for you uh, speed racers you can shift it over here and do a manual type shifting if you like I just like to leave it in drive here jump on the expressway get her up to um, highway speeds if you will just to show you how nice it tracks um, even at uh, freeway speeds said everything works turn signals yeah. rear window defroster A nice peppy little motor I mean no problem getting up to speed and that, that's not Ford I mean I'm not gonna tear this little car up but you can see I mean we get up to 80 miles an hour like that and uh, it's not pulling it, it drives really nice. So, good little car. I think that uh, th this is going to be a really nice economical car for somebody. And um, appreciate you watching our videos today. Or, or should I say our video today. And uh, if you could please like and subscribe. Appreciate it.